Hey guys, Thunder E here, and today we're taking a look at the best wireless buds under $50 in 2023. Yes, I know, there are a ton of buds that I haven't tried that are not here, but here are the buds that I've tried that I think will work for you, and you can pick up at any time of the year, else going into 2024, and especially during the holiday season. So if you're joining us for the very first time, smash that subscribe button, notification icon, so you can watch more videos like this on the channel. So I've got nine buds here in total, and as you can see, my back line is a Soundcore line, and the Soundcore makes a lot of really budget uh, true wireless buds. But I'm gonna start off here far left with this Edifier. This is the Edifier TWS-1 Pro 2. Uh, these are really nice true wireless buds. I like that they have come in different colors, especially like this light, like powder blue or baby blue color. Um, and they're very comfortable and small and compact. You can see the look and feel of these buds overall. They fit really nicely in your ears um, and they sound really, really good in terms of audio quality. They're sharp, they're clear. You don't have to crank up the volume to actually use this. Now, in terms of battery life, you're looking at 24 hours of battery life on them here with the case and about five to six hours, just the buds themselves, really solid. And his price point is under uh, $50, around $34 in total. So that's a good starting point. The next ones are these bad boys. These are the uh, J Labs J Buds Mini. Now you've seen a lot of the, talk about these on TikTok and on social media. These are truly the smallest true wireless buds you will find on the market. These things are really tiny, they're small. Um, when I take it out of the case, the case is small itself. I do like it, it, it does have like this ring hook you can use, comes in various colors as you expect. And again, these are the buds themselves, very small and very comfortable. Now, in terms of battery life, you're looking at about 20 hours of battery life on here, custom tips, they do fit really well and they're quite snug. Uh, and honestly, these are a good pair of buds to just carry around with you. You've got touch controls on there. Um, you can use the play, play, like I said, it just sounds good for its price point. It's about $28 now or so. So it's a really good pair of true wireless buds to use and have around or, or just an extra pair, just in case you lose it. Charges via USB type C. And honestly, it's, it's solid. For what it is, it's pretty good. We have the J Labs Go Air Pop. Now I have the Fruity Pebble version, which is pretty cool. Um, and of course, uh, you can see the, the multicolor look of the case itself. Now, what's pretty cool about this is the case has a USB cable attached to it, which is pretty nice. So you don't need to actually have uh, a cable with you. This is tucked into the case. You connect to USB ports and boom, you're good to go. It doesn't have any other charging ports on here. So that's the only way to charge this. Uh, small, compact, not as small as the J Buds Mini but very good. Again, you've got those multi fruity, fruity pebble colors overall. These things also sound really good. They are clear, they're sharp, they give you some really good audio and they work really well. They have a very nice fit and you know they feel really comfortable while you wear them. So I definitely like those. And again, they retail for about, I think 20 something dollars or something. Really good, affordable price point for most people. Here are the Amazon Echo Buds 2023. These are semi-enclosed fit, and you can see the flat nature of the case. I kind of like it. it, comes in white and black, USB uh, charging on the side. And then when we pull it out, you can see the design of the buds themselves, kind of reminiscent of the uh, Apple AirPods, but they are really nice. Now, the one thing I'll say, it's just my only annoyance with it is that you do need to set up Alexa to fully use these buds fully. But when you put them on, uh, the audio quality is great. And because of the tie-in voice assistant, it works really well. Uh, the fit is also comfortable. And this is a good alternative for people who don't like uh, cushion earbuds, but like these kind of style. They work very well. Audio quality is also pretty nice and is very customizable. Very comfortable, easy to use. Honestly, these are very nice for what they are. And this price point also under $50, I think goes a long way and pretty solid. Our fifth pair of buds are the um, One More uh, Piston Buds Pro. Now these are probably the best sounding of the bunch. One More makes some really good audio quality in terms of just audio fidelity. Uh, it's got really good sound, very comfortable, light and compact to wear. As you put them on, they fit really nicely in your ear all the way through. I like the way it fits uh, when I wear them. 
It's got Bluetooth 5.2. It's also got a gaming mode for basically better latency while gaming. Uh, you also have a battery life of 30 hours, so that's also pretty big as well. And this price point is about $32 right now. So again, very affordable, but probably the best audio quality out of the bunch. So that's our first roll right there. What about going into the sound core line? So start off with the Life A1 here. 35 hours of battery life. It's also got wireless charging as well. So something under 50 with wireless charging, which is great. Customizable EQs, all of them through the Soundcore app. Um, and it's got a very comfortable fit here. I like the little wing tips on them. Again, you can see how they look. They come in various colors as you expect. Uh, they fit comfortably, especially with the wing tips. So they're not falling off and these feel very comfortable to work out with as well. They've got a much more uh, sturdy feel for that. Audio quality is good, it is crisp, a little bit on the bassier side with the standard flow, but you've got a lot of EQs in the app to customize it. We've got the Life A3i. Now the A3i, I've got it in this kind of like beige color here. Very nice, 36 hours of battery life on this bad boy, custom EQs, air enhanced calling, and also the fit is actually pretty good. Even though there are no wingtips, it's still really comfortable in the ears you can see here. Uh, just a very comfortable fit and you've got touch controls, easy to use, also have active noise cancellation as well. So you have that with the buds, they're comfortable. The charging port is at the bottom, bottom there, which is a bit weird, so you can't actually place it flat to charge, it's gonna be on its side. Now, next off, we have the Life P2 Mini. Now, the P2 Mini are um, really good. They've got um, base, as I like to say here, mini buds with big base. So that's a lot of what it, it portrays. 32 hours of battery life, you've got about seven with each buds. They sound really good. And also the bass is also pretty clear. Not as clear as I would like, but it still gives you a lot of bass in there. And for its price point around 30 something dollars, you really can't go wrong here. Um, very comfortable buds to wear. Um, if you like the buds with the stems like these, these work really well. I think they're very comfortable and easy to use. And I think a lot of people will like them. And finally, we have the Life P3i. Now the P3i's are active noise cancellation. Um, they've also got the customized EQ audios and then 36 hours of battery life. So long battery life on them. And they've got that stem uh, design, uh, bigger drivers in here. And they pack in a lot of bass, probably the most bass around out of all of them. Um, and really full and rich bass all together that I think a lot of bass lovers will like. These are the pair that do the job for you. In terms of fit, I do think the fit is good, even though it feels a little bit loose, but it's still a very good fit overall. And I think these buds will make anyone who's a bass lover very, very happy. So those are the nine buds that I do like. And I think when you look at all of them here, let's start off with the bottom. Um, Soundcore gives you a variety of choices and design styles with a lot of battery life. Soundcore is pretty much a leader in battery life here in my list. When you're looking at the best audio quality, you gotta go with the uh, one more Piston uh, Buds Pro. These sound really, really good. In terms of functionality, it's the Amazon Echo Buds with Alexa built into it as well, and also good audio quality with a very different design. And the best bang for your buck has to go to the J Labs J Buds Mini. They're small, they're compact, and they sound really good. Plus, 20 hours plus of battery life, you can't go wrong. But any of these will work well for you, as the Edifier, uh, the, the uh, Go Air Pop, you name it. Let me know which ones you think or which ones you've actually picked up. Again, they're really affordable, great for the holidays, great for family or friends, or just great for a quick pair to pick up or have an extra in your bag in case you lose your main pair. So if you have any questions, any comments, let me know. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and always enjoy your entertainment.